So in this example, we have a cubic. And I know that it crosses the x-axis 1 half, 2, and 4. And I'm going to find the shaded area. So the shaded area consists of two sections. And for previous videos, I know that I really need to split this up into two separate integrals. OK? Um, I know also that this one will give me a negative integral. OK? So I need to contend with that. So what I want to do is integrate x cubed minus 13 halves x squared plus 11x minus 4. And I first want to integrate it between 1 half and 2. OK, and that's going to give me this region here. Now, because of a lack of symmetry here, this region will not be the same size as that one. So I do need to do two integrals. So integrating, add 1 to the power, divide by the new power. Add 1 to the power is dividing, and then I'm dividing by 3. So I'm going to get 13 over 6x cubed plus 11 um, x squared over 2, take away 4x, and I'm going to evaluate that between 1 half and 2. So substituting in 2 first, so we're going to have 2 to the 4 divided by 4, take away uh, 13 times 2 cubed uh, divided by 6, plus 11 times 2 squared divided by 2, take away 4 times 2, and that gets me 2 thirds. Okay, then I'm going to substitute in a half. Now be careful when substituting in a half. Okay, so we're going to get 0 0.5 to the 4 over 4, uh, take away 13 over 6 times 0 0.5 cubed. Uh, plus 11 over 2 times uh, 0 0.5 squared. Take away 4 times 0 0.5. So we get minus 169 over 192. So we have 2 thirds. Take away this is 99 over 64. So that is this region here, 99 over 64. Okay, then I need to do the same integrating, um, not bet well, not between a half now, I'm going to be integrating between 2 and 4. This x cubed minus 13 halves x squared plus 11x minus 4 dx. So I already have the integral there, so I don't need to do it again x to the 4 over 4 minus 13 over 6x cubed, rather, uh, plus 11x squared over 2, take away 4x, and evaluate it between 2 and 4. OK, so substituting in 4, I'm going to have 4 to the power of 4 divided by 4, take away 13 over 6 times 4 cubed, uh, plus 11 over 2, uh, 11 over 2 uh, times 4 squared. Take away 4 times 4. OK. Um, conveniently, my calculator has gone into decimals. So that's uh, minus 2 and 2 thirds. Um, so minus 2 and 2 thirds. Um, so we have uh, minus 8 thirds. And then take away substituting in 2. Now I already have substituted in 2 here. So that was 2 thirds. OK. So we have minus 8 thirds, take away 2 thirds. That's minus 10 thirds. So the integral is minus 10 thirds. But the actual area will just be 10 thirds. So the area is 99 over 64 plus the 10 over 3. So 99 over 64 plus 10 thirds is 937 over 192, which 
is approximately 4.88. Okay? So three significant figures. So you can see that you would need to split it up into two integrals here in order to evaluate. But there are some uh, little shortcuts because we've done the majority of the work in the first integral.